briefcase. What the hell are you doing? Give it! Pocket sand. Trick or drink! Trick or drink! Boo! I am a high-priced Washington lobbyist peddling influence. Who wants candy? Run, Hank! Portal to hell! Rematch? I thought we agreed never to discuss the horrors that we saw on the killing fields of the Fun Center. I know what's wrong with it. It's a Ford. You know what they say Ford stands for, don't you? It stands for fix it again, Tony. <laughs> You're thinking of a Fiat, Dale. Fix it again. Hank, you have bully ragged this production and stifled my creativity from day one. It is now day two. I quit. That makes a lot of sense. A lot of nonsense. <laughs> <laughs> I killed eight gophers last year and a purebred Tennessee walking horse that was looking at me funny. Is that a real computer? Yes. Oh, in that case, my name is Rusty Shackleford. Shackleford. You half-wits could be looking at jail time. Uh, uh my, my name is Shackleford, Rusty Shackleford. I refuse to speak without my attorney present. I am Mr. Shackleford's attorney, Rusty Shackleford. My client pleads insanity. Let me take this opportunity to introduce the band on keyboards, the big D himself, Rusty Shackleford. Dale Gribble? Maybe. Who's asking? Rusty Shackleford. D what? It's me, Dale. But, but that's impossible. Rusty died in third grade. I didn't die. I moved. You need to stop using my name, Dale. I am not using your name, and I am not Dale. Come on, Dale. You're smoking the same brand of cigarettes you did in the third grade. Get off my property, whoever I am! Whoa, Dale, this bridge goes into Mexico. Whoops, did I make a wrong turn? All right, let me try to spin around. Nope. Not yet. Now? Nope. Oh, well, we're in Mexico. What are you gonna do? All right, Twister. It's just you and me now. Ten years ago, you took my shit. Did you think I'd forget that? Come on, bring it on! Ah! No, please, let me go! This is no time for jokes, Boomhauer. This tornado's already classified at level two on the Fujisaki scale. A storm that strong will send an egg through a barn door. Two barn doors if one of them's open. What would a level three do, Mr. Gribble? Level three will send an egg through a brick wall. Tornado chasers call it Humpty's Revenge. I'll be in my think hole. My do! Yeah. How could you do this to me, Puff Puff? My cigarettes! Yeah. Yeah. No! Jackass! This course is the feces that is produced when shame eats too much stupidity! You people make me envy the deaf and the blind! Underwear! Money! Fat! And the pockets are big enough for an umbrella! Shishisha! Joseph will love it. Quit screwing around with my mower! You've got to be kidding. I don't kid about my mower. Now get inside and start massaging my wife. Computers don't make errors. What they do, they do on purpose. By now, your name and particulars have been fed into every laptop, desktop, mainframe, and supermarket scanner that collectively make up the global information conspiracy, otherwise known as the Beast. 
Hey, I know what's wrong with your truck. It's your quote-unquote pollution controls. I heard on talk radio you don't even need them. They're just neghead government plot. How is cutting down on pollution a government plot, Dale? Open up your eyes, man. They're trying to control global warming. Get it? Global. So what? That's code for UN commissars telling Americans what temperature it's going to be in our outdoors. I say let the world warm up. See what Boutros Boutros golly golly thinks about that. We'll grow oranges in Alaska. Dale, you giblet head. We live in Texas. It's already 110 in the summer, and if it gets one degree hotter, I'm going to kick your ass. What are you asking Bill for? The army destroyed all his brain cells with their deadly placebo drug. No wonder he's an ignoranus. What did you say? Ignoranus. It means stupid, you moron. Dale, you said placebo. Yeah, I read it in Bill's file. That was the name of the drug they gave him. Placebo. I think it's made by Pfizer. Damn it, Dale. 